Hi, this is Mato. In this video, I will show you a game between Magnus Carlsen and Evgeny Tomaszewski. This is a game from Tata Steel Chess Tournament. It was played in the Netherlands in 2016. Magnus Carlsen had white pieces and he started with d4. Evgeny Tomaszewski played knight to f6, knight to f3, e6, bishop to f4, b6, e3, bishop to b7, h3. So if knight goes to h5, bishop goes to h2, bishop to e7, bishop to d3, and both players castle at king's side. c5, defending the pawn on d4, knight to c6, that's from b to d2, d5, queen to e2, bishop to d6, white to move. This position was seen many times before. For most played moves in this position are bishop takes bishop, knight to e5, bishop to g5, and bishop to e5. Carlsen played rook from f to e1, a novelty, which may become popular. Is this better than the moves just shown, these four moves? Maybe this is not a better move, but it worked well, because Tomaszewski didn't take the bishop. He thought that Carlsen probably prepared something. So instead of bishop takes and pawn takes on a he played knight to e7. Rook from a to d1. When you look at the position, it appears that white pieces somehow stand better. That's just a feeling. Knight to g6. Bishop takes knight. H takes on g6. Bishop takes bishop. Queen takes bishop. Knight to e5 g5 because f4 is coming and this is what Carson played f4 g takes on f4 and now very 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 cunning move rook to f1 what's so special about this well with this move Carson allowed black to capture the pawn on e3 he did allow, but Tomaszewski did not take. He played knight to d7. Why not pawn takes pawn? Let's have a look. If pawn takes pawn, then rook takes on f6. And after pawn takes a queen to g4 check. Now I'm going to show you a line which is not covering everything, but this is just an idea to, to show you what may have happened if Pawn takes pawn was played. So, possible continuation. King to h7, rook to f1, pawn takes knight, rook to f4, pawn takes knight on e5, check. King to g7, rook to g4, check. King to f6, queen to g5, checkmate. So this is the main idea. That is why Tomaszewski played knight to d7. It is white to move. White. Play the move. Would you believe it? White. Play the move. And then black also play the move. Attacking the queen with the knight. Queen to h4. Queen to d8. 
Rook takes on f4. Knight to e4. Knight takes knight. Queen takes queen. Rook takes queen. D takes on e4. D takes on c5. B takes on c5. The dust has settled. Who is better? White is better. White has a better pawn structure plus rook to d7 was played. Invasion on the 7th rank. Material is equal. But white has a winning position. The threat is now rook takes bishop. Rook from a to b8 defending. b3. a5. Rook to c7, threatening rook takes pawn. And then white has a pass pawn on c file. a4. b takes on a4. Bishop to a8. White to move. What would you do? What is the best move for white in this position? Would you capture the pawn? This is not the best move. Carson played the best move. a5. What's wrong with rook takes on c5? Then rook from f to c8 and black is fighting back. Okay, a5 was played. Rook to b7. Well, Rook from f to c8 doesn't work because of rook takes pawn on f7. So we have rook to b7 and now rook takes on c5. Rook to a7. White to move. White. Play the move. And black resigned. Please pause the video. and find the winning move that Carlsen played. What did you find? Carlsen played knight to c4. Black resigned. I know that my chess friends would like to see few more moves. So I created a possible continuation. Please note this is not the only continuation. Just a possible one. Rook to d8, placing the rook on the open file, threatening a check. King to f2, g6, preventing rook to h5. Knight to b6, threatening knight takes bishop and then rook takes pawn. f5, defending the pawn. g4, king to g7, and now g5. Rook to d2, check. Makes sense, doesn't it? King to g3, rook to e2, knight takes bishop, rook takes on e3 check, king to f4, rook to f3 check, king to e5, and now what else but to take this knight, rook takes knight, rook to c7 check, king to g8, king to f6, rook to f8 check. King takes pawn on g6. e3. Just two squares away from the glory. White to move. And to checkmate in one. Rook to g7. Check. Mate. That is why. Tomaszewski designed in this position. Position was totally lost. What do you think of this game? And that is all. I hope that you enjoyed watching this video. I wish you good luck with your chess and bye for now.